Hi, I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Move Love, and this is your full body dumbbell AMRAMP. If you love at-home workouts, hit subscribe to our YouTube channel, or better yet, click that join button and become part of our YouTube community for more accountability and support. All right, you guys, we are coming at you with the AMRAMP format today, as many rounds as possible. You've loved this format and asked for it, so we're bringing it back. And I'm joined by the amazing Rachel. Hi. She'll be offering modifications throughout today's workout and showing you how you can do everything from the ground with just your dumbbells. I'm gonna be using the box here. You could use a chair, a bench, an ottoman, a bottom stair of a staircase. Use whatever you have available to you. And today's workout is extra special because it's brought to you in partnership with our sponsor, the Northern Pulse Growers Association, which is a nonprofit representing dry pea, lentil, lupin, fava bean, chickpea, growers located in North Dakota and Montana. We're located right here in Minnesota, so those are our surrounding neighbors, and we love them because they grow 80 to 85% of all the pulses in the US. That's crazy. That's amazing. Yeah. That's amazing. And by the time this workout drops, it's gonna be dropping to you in February, which February is the American Heart Month, and pulses are like an amazing source of heart healthy recipes. If you're looking for heart healthy recipes, you gotta include pulses into your diet and a special call out for February 10th, which is World Pulses Day. So if there's any day to incorporate pulses into your diet, it is February 10th. Make sure you reach for those chickpeas, lupins, fava beans, lentils. What's your favorite? All that good stuff. I love lentils. They're so easy to just throw in anything. Yeah. Such a good source of fiber too. Yeah. Like if I'm low in fiber, I reach for lentils. Yeah. I'm a chickpea girl through and through. I just open that can, dump them into any Things, sheep pan meals, you name it, so good. So thank you Northern Pulse Growers Association for bringing this workout to you and dropping some fun tidbits about how we can incorporate pulses into our daily lives. Now let's get started with this AMRAMP workout, you guys. All right, today's workout is broken down into four big AMRAMPs, okay? You're gonna do each AMRAMP for four minute blocks. There are two moves per AMRAMP. We'll break it down, walk you guys through it as we go. So Rachel and I are actually gonna hit the ground. We're gonna warm up a little differently today just to keep you guys interested and, and engaged. We're gonna put the right foot forward, left knees on the ground, just holding on to something to support us. Again, you can use whatever you have, a chair. We're gonna warm up with hip flexor activation. So you're just gonna lift this leg up, activating this hip flexor and hold for three, two, one. Set it down, reset, inhale, exhale, core comes tight, lift and hold. So you're engaging your core as well as your hip flexor. Set it down, you're gonna do two more just like it. Lift and hold, hold for three, Two, one, nice. This last one, see how far you can get that heel off the ground. Lift and hold, hold for three, two, one. Nice work from here. You're gonna take your hands, place them inside your right foot, step back on that left leg, and you're gonna go for a Spider-Man reach. So you're just gonna open it up and then set it down. Let's do it again, this time open. Now bend your arm and can you get your elbow down? You're gonna challenge yourself to open up those hips. Nice, do it again, open up and get that elbow. Can you get the elbow down towards the shoe, the mat, wherever it is for you today? Nice work, awesome job. From here, set it down, plant the hands right here, bring it in, and we are gonna go right into a low lunge. So just hold this lunge, hold. Now you're holding a lunge, activating both the legs, hold it here, hold for three, two, one, switch it out. Same thing, hip flexor activations, this time other leg. Again, you're gonna lift and hold, hold for three, two, a one, set it down, there you go. Nice, lift that knee up, get that heel off the ground. Hold, hold for three, two, one. I like to place on my other hand, just right on my core so I can feel it fire up as I pull that knee up. Set it down, you got one more, one more. Here we go, lift and hold, hold for three, two, one. Same thing, set it down, take your hands inside the foot, step back on that right leg, left arm's gonna open up, easy twist. Set it down, do it again, this time bend the elbow. Right here, bend the arm. Can you drop that elbow down towards the ground, the shoe? Whatever you can reach today, do it again. Open all the way back up. Now drop it down, drop it down, drop it down. Nice, hold it here, just opening up those hips. Awesome job, set the hands down. Find that low lunge, find it. Hold that low lunge, just hold, hold for three, two, one, nice work. Rachel's gonna stay on the ground facing you. I'm gonna come to the back. I'm gonna put one leg up against my box here. And we're just gonna go into a little rock and stretch. I like to call this the couch stretch, opening up those hip flexors we just activated. You're gonna hinge forward, driving knee over toe, and then you're gonna come back, reach up, opening up hip flexor, hinge forward, knee over toe, and then reach up, big reach, opening up this hip flexor. If you're Rachel, you're tucking that tailbone, hinge forward and come back. Nice, we are gonna do Bulgarian lunges in today's workout. Rachel's gonna give you a split lunge. I'm gonna launch off right here and I'm gonna go into a Bulgarian lunge, down and up. 
single leg lunge, shoelaces down on that box, that chair, ottoman, whatever you're using today, driving through that front heel. Go four, nice, three, and two, and one. Switch it out, switch it out. So my other leg is gonna butt up to that box. Rachel's just gonna swap it out right here. Hinge forward, knee over toe. Reach it up, trying to get my butt to my heel. Reaching up, opening up that hip flexor. Hinge forward, and then open it up. Nice, so on that hinge, I'm thinking knee over toe, opening up those hips. On the rock back, I'm thinking butt to heel, opening up hip flexor of the leg that is on the ground. One more, hinge forward, rock back. Nice, from here, get yourself up into that Bulgarian lunge, that split lunge. You go down and up, driving through that front heel. Shoelaces down if you're with me. Feet are stable on train tracks with Rachel. Go four, nice, three, and two, and one. Awesome job, team. We're gonna go into some rows. I'm gonna show you an incline row because that's what we're gonna do in the workout today. We're gonna start by setting it up. Rachel's gonna go to a quadru or quadrupedal position on all fours. Scap retraction, drop your chin, so lock out your arms. You drop your chest and then pull the shoulder blades apart. Drop your chest to the floor towards the box. Now pull your shoulder blades apart. Do it two more times. Drop your chest and then pull it apart. Drop your chest and then pull it apart. Nice. We're gonna go into rows. I'm gonna come down to my forearms. I'm gonna be performing row like this. Row and row. Go. Four, three. Rachel could always take it to a plank if she wanted to. The last one, switch your arm right here. Row. Four, three, two, one. Nice work. Awesome job. From here, we can just push this Betty, we call my box. Betty, we'll push Betty off to the side. Nice, I'm just gonna keep her down, push her off to the side, and let's do some squats. All right, let's squat it out right here. You're gonna drop it down and up. Squat it out, gonna start to get warm. So today's workout looks like this. You got eight moves. Each circuit contains two of them. So you have four circuits. Four circuits, two moves per circuit. Each circuit is performed, each AMRAMP, in a four minute block. You're gonna work for four minutes between those two moves completing as many reps as you can, and through those two moves, we'll give you the rep count in four minutes. Go four, go three, go two, and one. Let's just jack it out, jacks or taps, jacks or taps for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, one. Nice work, shoulder sweeps. If you're with me, you're gonna do three minutes of work in that block, switch directions. The last minute, we're gonna call the power minute. You're gonna pick up the intensity, and possibly go into a plyometric or a higher impact. Just left those arms. Option, stay with Rachel. Option, go to the power minute with me. You get to decide your workout, yes? Nice work, take it nice and wide. Side to side lunges for the finish. Hit side, center, side, center. Go four, nice, go three, yes, go two, and one. Bring it in, bring it in, high knees, high knees. Get them up, get them up for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, Three, two, one. You ready, Rach? Good mobility today. Nice. I like that. I like it too. If I don't build it into my workout, I don't do it, right? You got two moves. First circuit, it's a four minute block. It's bilateral. We go bilateral, unilateral, which means we're doing two feet on the ground for your first exercise, right? We're doing heels up squats. You guys love these. You love them and you ask for more of them. So I'm just gonna use weights. You could, you could use a book. You could slide under your heels. I'm gonna place my heels right here. You are gonna give me 10 heel up squats. You can hold two weights at your side, just like this, 10 squats. From there, you're gonna come off the weights and you're gonna go into 10 alternating curl press. Curl, push, that's one, two. So really it's five per arm. 10 heel up squats, 10 alternating curl press. You're gonna just work through those two moves for four minutes. How many reps, how many rounds can you get through? If you're with me, again, you'll stop at three minute mark and we will go into a power minute. Rachel's gonna stay with these two moves. Are you guys ready to start your first Let's four minute go. block? Let's do it. 10 heel up squats, 10 alternating curl press. We go in three, we go in two, let's go. We go 10. Again, it's all time, so you get to go at your pace. You can always slow this down. If you wanna stick with us, you can. All right, nice work, you guys. Nice, that's five, you got five more. Five, four, three, two, one, those heels come off there. Here we go, curl press, curl press on the right. One, nice, you're just working through this. Two, we're gonna get to 10. And you're gonna go right back into it. Three, 
You can work through this at your pace, your tempo. You can go slower and heavier, lighter and faster. It's all your pace. Nice work. It's as many rounds as possible through these two exercises as you can. You got two more if you're with us. Once on the right, here we go. Once on the left. Heels get back on those weights. Heel up squats, heel up squats. Nice. These are great. You're doing 10 of them again. Nine. Gonna work a little bit more quad dominant. That's the top of our thighs is what we're working here with the heel up squat. If you have limited ankle mobility, really great way to work on your range of motion in squats as well. Two more, two more. If you're with us, nice. Heels come off. Again, now you're working through 10 curl press. Nice. There we go. Four minutes of these two moves. How many reps can you get through? Very strength focused if you wanna keep it here. Option to add a little bit more intensity and hit that power minute with me. Nice work, you guys. Stay in it. Nice. Come on, come on, yes you can. If you're with us, you got one more each arm, one more each arm, once on the right, come on. Once on the left. Going a little bit heavier and slower today. Gonna try and stick with these 20s the whole time. Go 10, come on. Nine, you got this. Eight, let's go. Seven, stay with it. Six, yes you can. Nice work, get through these squats, get through these squats. Nice work, you guys. If you're with me, you got one more minute on the strength. Two more, down up, last one. Okay, if you're with Rachel, you got two minutes left in this circuit, in this AMRAP. If you're with me, one minute on the strength, and then we transition, power minute. I'm gonna show you those moves. Option, squat jumps or goblet squat jump, 10 of them, right into 10 press jacks. We're gonna stay on the legs and shoulders, squats and shoulders. Come on, you got this. One more curl press each way, one more curl press each way, let's go. Other arm, other arm. Back to heel up squats, back to heel up squats. 30 seconds, transitioning with me into that power minute. 30 seconds, option, stick with these two moves and hang with Rachel. Choose your adventure, right? Right, choose your adventure, I love it. We had Wendy who said she loves the four minute working block and the power minute. Sometimes she sticks with me and sometimes she goes with Rachel. You get to pick your adventure. You've got choices. If you're with me, we transition in four, three, Two, I'm transitioning. I got 10 goblet squat jumps. I'm gonna try and keep this 20 pound. One of them, here we go, 10 of them. 10, nine, eight. If you're with Rachel, you're just sticking it in. Nice work, come on. You got this. Nice, three, two, one. Press jacks, 10 press jacks right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, 10, 30 down, 30 to go in that power minute. Let's go. 10, nine, eight, yes, Rachel. Seven, stay with it. Six, it should burn. Woo, five, four, three, legs up, fire. Two, one, press jacks. Here we go, finish 10. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. We all got five seconds, final five. Four, three, two, one. Holy bananas. There you go. Whew. AMRAMP one. Good way to start. AMRAMP one. Whew, rest for a minute. Rest for one minute between AMRAMPs. Grab some water. One minute rest. And then we hit unilateral. I'm going to bring the box in. Rachel's going to stay on the mat. I'm going to catch my breath. One of those workouts is like simple, but effective. You'll feel this, right? Yeah, simple but effective. Yeah. All right, Rachel's gonna give you split lunges. I'm gonna give you Bulgarians, so I'm gonna use the box, okay? You're gonna do eight on the right leg, eight on the left leg, and then I'm gonna flip over and go into incline rows. Eight on the right arm, eight on the left arm. Rachel's got single arm. We go in 10 seconds. Doesn't matter which leg you use, you're gonna do eight. Either a split lunge or Bulgarian. We go in three. Two, new four minute block, new four minute block. Eight, seven, six, nice. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch your legs, switch your legs. Eight on the other leg, eight on the other leg. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Nice work, team. Three, two, 
One, eight rows, single arm. I'm gonna go to an incline. Placing one forearm here, row for eight. Go eight, seven, six, five. Nice work. Four, three, two, one. Switch arms, switch arms. Okay, this is gonna take us longer to get through because you're just doing single-sided exercises. Nice, four down, four to go. Last four, three, two, one. That whole round got us through one minute of work. You got three minutes left in this block. Can you get through three more rounds? Let's see. Go eight, seven, six, five. Nice work, team. Four, three, yes, two, one. Switch your leg, switch your leg. Crushing it, guys. Eight, seven, six. Nice work, Rage. Five. Did I, I, I miss, I think I missed it. Three. Three. Two. Two. One. That's why we're we here. <laughs> Teamwork makes the... Dream work, baby. Yes. Eight. Come on, eight rows. Eight rows per arm. You can add that incline, which I like. Gives you that nice extension at the bottom. Full extension, a little bit of core engagement. One more. Switch your arm, switch your arm. Go eight. Come on. Nice, guys, come on. Stay with it. Stay with it. You got three, two, one. We're slowly losing time. Nice, that took us a minute and five seconds. Here we go, keep cruising. Let's go, eight. Again, it's as many rounds as possible for you. What does this workout look like for you today? Where are you at? Two more, come on, last one. Switch your leg. These get me every time. So tough. I don't know what it is, I'm always sore from doing these. Famously tough, right? They're known Single. for being hard. Single-sided exercises are just so stinking hard for me. Two more, last one, nice. Rose, let's go, if you're with me, you got 20 seconds, you switch to that power minute. Power minute, eight. I'm gonna tell you what it is, eight lunge jumps. Eight burpee back rows. It's brutal, guys. Eight lunge jumps, eight burpee back rows. Nice work, three. Nice, I gotta switch my arms. I gotta finish this out. We're gonna do eight rows. Eight, seven, then we go into it. Six, five, four, three, two. I'm finishing it, keeping it equal. All right, if you're with Rachel, stick with it. Back to lunges, if you're with me, lunge jumps. Go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Find your weights, two of them. Let's go, burpee back row. One, nice work, let's go. Come on, two, you got eight, you got eight. Three, it's the power minute. It's meant to push you, four. Come on, you only got 30 seconds left. Five, stay with it. Yes, six, woo, crushing it. Come on, seven, eight. Back to lunge jumps, eight of them, let's go. Eight. Seven, six, you're under 10 seconds. 10 seconds, finish. Three, two, one. Burpee back row for the final four. Three, two, one. Woo! Nice work, Air Liz. ramp two. Lunch jump, baby. Two down, two to go. Rest for one minute. Rest for one minute, okay? These four minute blocks are truly meant to challenge you. I feel like this is where everyone was like, I could use a commercial break right now, right? Like, I'm not gonna hit pot, I'm not gonna skip it, I'm gonna take your rest. <laughs> hit me with the ad. Ah, uh, the four minutes, you don't wanna rest. You get this one minute to rest. Circuit three, back to bilateral. 10 deadlift clean. Into 10 overhead triceps. I'm gonna use two weights for the deadlift clean. Hinge, clean up to the shoulders, heels pop. Heels pop, weight to shoulders, 10 of those. And I drop down to one weight, 10 overhead triceps, okay? We go in 10 seconds, find the weights you wanna use. New four minute block, new four minute block. In three, in two, let's go. Deadlift, clean, that's one. You got 10, two, squats or deadlifts, Rach, which kind of girl are you? Oh, deadlifts. Three, me too. Yeah. <laughs> Six, come on. Seven, let's go. You got 10 again. Eight, all the way to 10. Nine, 10. Weights are down. Triceps, 
Overhead harder when the heart rate's high. Go 10, nine, close, the, oh, close off. What do I always say? Close, the, close those eyes. Get those away. eyes. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to deadlift. 10 deadlifts clean. If you don't want to do the clean, you don't have to. It's just an option to add some power. Heels pop. Drive those weights up. Come on, come on. Nice work, team. Five, four, three. Stay with it. Two, last one. Drop to one weight. Drop to one weight. 10 triceps. Come on, as many rounds as you can in four minute blocks. Break it down into four minutes at a time. Break it down one rep at a time. Last five, four, three, two, one. Back to 10. We put that timer on the screen for you. Nice work. We had someone say, I love seeing that timer on the screen so I can truly go at my pace. Pace yourself, right? You see that timer? Pace yourself. How many rounds can you get through without breaking? Without breaking, yes? Stay in it, guys. Two more, two more. Last one, last one. Nice work if you're with me. You got one minute of work left. One minute of work, two minutes if you're with Rachel. If you're with me, you're gonna hit that power minute. That power minute. We go 10 alternating snatches. That is five snatches per arm. Right into 10 overhead marches. It's getting hard. Three, two, one. Holy bananas, Rage. Holy bananas. There it Woo! is. Come on. We just stack up the reps on workouts like this, yeah. right? Like. You just take two moves and you go ham. That's what I do when I'm short on time. It's effective, guys. It's effective. Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, 10 seconds if you're with me. 10 seconds. Here we go. You're with me, power minute. Alternating snatches in five, four, three, two, one. Finish with yours, Rachel. If you're with me, here we go. On the right, and then the left. You go five per arm, 10 total. 10 snatches total, five per arm. All the way up overhead. Remember that big zipper effect? Zip it up. Keep that dumbbell tight. Stop bending the knees, drive through the heels. Lock it out, come on. Two more, two more, one more per arm if you're with me. And then you go into 10 overhead marches. That's hard. I don't know if I got overhead in me, I'm right here. 10, nine, eight, seven, six. I gotta let that heart rate come down. Three, two, one, back to snatches. Let's go, come on. What would it look like? What would it look like if I said 10 more seconds here, team? 10 more. What do you got for me today? What do you got? Last four, three, two, timer down, weights down. Woo! Three rounds down, three rounds down. One to go, guys. Rest for a minute. Rest for a minute, grab your water. Whew. One more round. One more round, team, that's it. One more round. Round number four, right? And we get to lay down for this one, right? <laughs> we do, we go back to unilateral. I'm gonna bring in the box. Rachel's gonna go to the ground, okay? Single leg, you can always take it to double leg because it's gonna be spicy. <laughs> it's gonna be spicy. Okay, we're gonna stay on your backside the entire time, which sounds better. But trust me, when you're in it, I don't think it's gonna be better. I really don't, I'm just you're being really honest. selling it, Lindsay. Yeah. I'm just telling you the truth. I mean, sometimes you gotta work hard, right? You gotta work hard. It's gotta, you gotta cause a little bit of pain, discomfort, and work through that. So we all get better. Okay, I'm just gonna have one heavy weight with me, right? One heavy weight. I'm going shoulders, upper back on my box. Rachel's going on the ground. You can do this single leg or double leg. Single leg's obviously gonna be harder. If you're a single leg, it is eight per side. Okay, so I'm gonna start with one leg on the ground, doesn't matter. Dumbbell's gonna go on the hip of the foot that's on the ground. I go eight, eight, seven, 
six. Once I get through all eight, I hold it here, and then I bring the dumbbell to the opposing hand, hold the single leg, and I go eight, single leg chest press. And then I switch my leg, I go eight here, into eight single on, on the chest. Does that make sense? It's bananas. It's gonna burn. Straight up bananas, <laughs> it's gonna burn. It's gonna burn. Four minutes, it's your last four. See, I can do anything for four minutes. Yes, I can. Doesn't matter which leg, just choose one. Choose one, you go eight reps in three, two, let's go down. Drive through the heel, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here, hold it here. Take the weight to the opposing arm. Opposing arm, single leg hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, you're gonna switch your leg, thank goodness. Thank goodness, here we go. Eight on the other leg. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Come on, three, two. Hold it here, take the weight to the opposing arm. Eight, eight, seven, it's hard, you gotta fight for it. Six, five, four, three, two, one, switch your leg, switch your leg. Let's go. Come on. Eight, that's one minute down. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Can you hold that single leg? Come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Just find your rhythm. Three, count those reps. Two, one. Oh, it's getting harder, getting harder, getting harder. Let's go. Come on. Eight. Where well, you just said one minute. That reminded me of our Metcon workout where we were doing burpees and you said one minute left. And I was like, oh. one minute. <laughs> See, you are so strong. You can do anything for a minute. Yes? Eight. Seven. Switch to chest press. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One more minute if you're with me. Two minutes if you're with Rachel. We're gonna switch that power minute. Eight, seven, six, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Come on, eight chest press. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, ah, whoo, let's go. Yes, give me eight, seven, 30 seconds if you're with me. Five, find your rhythm, find your zone. Four, three, wait, one more. Okay, hold it, okay, there we go. Here we go, eight, seven, come on, finish it. Six, if you're with me, you're transitioning, you're standing up. Three. Two, one, if you're with Rachel, Godspeed, stay there. Woo, I'm glad I get a switch. Here we go, eight high lows, eight high lows. Here's me, high, low, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, eight push-ups, eight push-ups. Not sure what's better, Rachel you or me. Eight, Choose your seven, adventure. Six, Five, this is it guys. Four, final circuit. Three, no bonus round. Two, one, no bonus round. Come on, come on, 20 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Eight push-ups, eight push-ups, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, come on. One, you're done, that timer's done. Oh. Holy stinking bananas. Amram, brutal. Woo. Way to go, Liz. Way to go, Rage. High fives. Oofta. At home. Northern Pulse Growers Association. That is one for the books. Yeah. One, four, 
the books, Northern Pulse Scars. Holy stinking bananas. Woo, let's stretch, Rachel. Let's, let's just do it. Right that here. sounds good, doesn't let's it? Let's go seated. Let's go seated, butterfly, because it feels good. All right. You guys, the reason we love pulses is because they are so great for workout recovery. You just crush this workout. Ouch, it hurt. Yeah, a little bit. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> but so good for workout recovery. All right, you have your chickpeas, your lentils, your fava beans, lupins. All these things are a great source of plant-based protein if you're looking for sources of plant-based protein. Also, love that they are super iron and fiber rich, something a lot of us, especially women, tend to be lacking in our diets. Iron and fiber, great source of that. Also a great source of folate, especially for those who are going through pregnancy. I know I took a folate supplement through most of my pregnancy. Really great source of folate for pregnancy. All right, Rachel, let's turn it. Here we go, let's go heels till your 40, or legs bent at 90 degrees, fingertips towards your butt. Big inhale up here, just spread that chest apart. Nice work, you guys. So proud of you for crushing this AMRAP workout. Again, big thanks to our sponsors, the Northern Pulse Scores Association, for sponsoring this workout and bringing us some educational tidbits. I love something I've learned from them is the half cup, half cup habit. I've been striving, let's go 90, 90. 90 degrees here, 90 degrees there. Split your chest right over your shin in half. Striving for that half cup habit, a half cup of pulses. Three, three, times, a week. three times a week. Three times a week. That's three stuck in my head. Yeah. I heard it one time and I was like, that's such an easy way to remember that. Right, yeah. something I can totally do. Let's lift up this back knee, set it down. Now lift up your back heel, set it down. Nice, switch it out. Yes, it's so attainable too. And I love that they're so affordable and easy to access. Easy like, to add to anything. Anything, too. literally. We were just talking like, about that. I open up a can of chickpeas and I dump a half cup into a salad. I made this like random like chickpea and white bean, cucumber, kind of like clean out the fridge, onion, whatever you have on hand. Throw a little olive oil on it, a little Yum. lemon, and you're good to go, right? Yum. If you want to find more heart healthy, awesome, packed pulse recipes, you can check out northernpulse.com. Northernpulse.com, they have a whole host of recipes teaching me new ways, because I really have kind of like, I, I stick to chickpeas and lentils because they're what I know best. But really starting to explore a little bit more of those like lupins and fava beans and dry peas and just how you can incorporate more of those into your diet. Again, iron, protein, all those good things. Heart we health. We love heart health around here. Yes. Right? Like, yes. yeah, so We're good. after our workout. So thank you, Northern Pulse goers. Check out northernpulse.com and we'll see you back on the mat for another workout really soon. Thanks so much for crushing that AMRAP. If you loved it, hit subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you like this format, you would absolutely love this workout I've queued up right here. Otherwise, if you love this heart pumping, metabolic conditioning, check out our free Metcon 100 program right here. Two weeks, heart pumping workouts you're gonna love. Have a great day.